Hi friends, my name is Miss Thomas and I will be doing a pre-K and kindergarten math lesson, okay? Let's get started right with our um, objectives. Are we ready? So let's look, look at it. Our objectives say I can use verbal and ordinal numbers to count like first, second, third, fourth, and fifth, okay? Another object that says I can name common shapes like a circle, an oval, a triangle, a rectangle, and even a hexagon. And then another objective we're going to cover is um, a demonstration of position words. Where can I find something that's on top, that's under, and maybe even next to? So let's jump right on in the lesson. Right now, we're going to start with a picture walk called the circus. Have anybody ever been to the circus before? Really? Me too. So what we're going to do is we're going to take a picture walk and we're going to find some of the things that we find in a circus or they look like shapes. What do we see first? What do we see second? What's the circle on top? What's the circle on the bottom? Let's take a look. Are we ready? Cool. Let's see. I'm excited. Are you excited? Absolutely, I'm excited. Look at the family. We have some families. They're going to a circus. I already see some shapes. Do you? Cool. I'm glad you do. So let's see what's coming next in our book. Oh, wow. Look at those shapes. Do you see them? Yes, I see them too. Can you name them? Not yet, but I bet by the end of this book you will. Cool. Okay, let's see what else that's in our book. Mmm, I like it. Oh, wow. Look at the ringmaster. He's standing on some long stilts. Do you know what those stilts are called? They are long, tall rectangles. I see them. Let's see what else we see in our book. Oh, wow. Look at this. You see elephants too? Me too. What are the elephants pushing? Circles? Yes, they are pulling circles. They are. Let's see what else that's in our book. Oh, wow. Look at the marching band. Look at their hats. Can you know what the shape of their hats are? Yeah, they're squares. Look at the drummer. We saw one of those shapes before. It's in the shape of a, a circle. You're right. Good job. Let's see what else we got. You're going to be excited. Look at that. Horses. And on the horses' backs, there's some shapes. Can you guess what they are? Yes, they are triangles. I like that you know this. Let's see what else we can see. Wow. What else can we see at the circus? Yeah, I see monkeys too, but we're looking for the shapes. Yes. Yeah, those are squares. I love squares too. Let's see what else. Are you liking this picture book walk? I'm liking it too. Let's see what else we have. Oh, look at these animals that we find at the circus. Remember, we're looking for shapes at the circus. Did someone say rectangles? You're absolutely right. I see rectangles. The bears are holding rectangles. How cool is that? Let's see what else we have going on in our circus book walk. Look at the very end of the circles of the circus. It says shapes everywhere. Do you see the shapes that we talked about in the book? Yes. What did we see first? We saw maybe rectangles. Yeah. Saw some circles. Absolutely. We saw triangles, squares, rectangles. You did a great job at looking for all the things or all the shapes at a circus. You did really good. I like that you took a great book. I'm sorry, took a great picture book walk with me. 
So I'm going to close that up. And now we're going to talk about some of the shapes that you did see in the book. Okay. I'm going to hold up a shape and I want to see if you can, you can name it. That shape, you know what? I didn't see that shape in the book, but I bet you know what that shape is. This is called an octagon. It has like eight sides. We really like to talk about hexagons because that's just easier to remember. But it's cool to know this shape. Did we see it in the book? No, I didn't see it in the book either. But it's okay to know that shape. Let's look, look at another shape. Did you see that shape in the book? Yes, I did too. It's a what? A triangle. You're right. It is a triangle. Let's see if we saw another shape in the book. Yes, did you see the shape? Well, so did I. The shape is called a, a square. You guys are pretty smart out there. Yes, that's a square. Okay, did we see this shape in the book? No, I don't recall seeing that shape, but you know what? I have one of those on my shirt. It's a heart and I have one inside my chest. It makes me nice. I bet it makes you nice too. We like hearts. Let's see. I think we saw one of these shapes in this book. Yes, the shape is a rectangle. Good thinking. Rectangle. Oh, let's look at that shape. I don't remember this shape, but I bet it's an important shape. This shape is called a rhombus. Yeah, we didn't see it in the book, but we need to know this shape it's called a rhombus you got it it's a rhombus i saw this shape in the book it was like on the ring master's hat that's the guy that's in charge of the circus can you guess what this shape is gosh you guys are smart yes it is a star great job it is a star let's look at another shape Yes, I saw that shape too. I saw that shape too. That shape is a circle. Yes, it is a circle. This is a what? A oval. We didn't see any ovals in there, but we need to know that shape. An oval. Very nicely done. I like that. Good job at remembering the things that we found in this book. Those things are called shapes. I like that. But you know what's real fun that we can do? We can do a shape hunt around our house. We can find all kinds of shapes. You know what? I went on a shape hunt in my house. I found a few shapes that I saw in this book. Are you ready? I'm ready to. Let's see. Here's one that I found in my refrigerator. Can you guess what this is? Yes, it's an egg and an egg is shaped like an oval. If I turn it sideways, if I turn it to the tall way, it's still shaped like an oval. Do you know I like eating eggs for breakfast? You too? Good, cool, I like that. So let's see what else we found. Oh, I found a square in my house. This is called a coaster. This is what I put a drink on. So just in case I don't want it to waste on anything. So I found a square in my house. Did we find a square in the book? Yes, we did. So when you get a chance and you get to go on a shape hunt, I want you to go find some of the cool things in your house. Oh, let's see what else I found. Oh, you know what else I found in my house? I found another circle. It's a candle. The top of it is shaped like a circle. The bottom of it is shaped like a circle. And if I just hold it up, it looks like a cylinder, but we're really looking for a circle. So if I turn it that way, it's a circle. So my candle is shaped like a circle. Guess what else I found in my house? I found a rhombus. Do you see the rhombus on my vase? There's a rhombus right there. There's a rhombus. I see the rhombus. 
And guess what else is in my rhombus? Triangles. Look at that. Look at the triangle way at the bottom. It's a triangle. That's part of the rhombus. And if I turn my vase this way, it's shaped like a hexagon. Yes, a hexagon. One, two, three, four, five, six. A hexagon. My vase, my vase has three shapes. Cool. And you know what else I found in my house? I went to my pantry and I found a tall rectangle. You see the tall rectangle? You guys eat this cereal too? Me too. They are good because it says tricks are for kids. And we're kids out there. But my box is shaped like a tall rectangle. So when you get a chance, when you get home, maybe you can go on a shape hunt in your house. Everything is right there. Yes. So let's talk about some of the things that we saw first, second, third. So let's go over those numbers that we talked about, that Miss Thomas talked about. I see the number right here. That's one. Good. You know what this number is? You don't? It's okay. I'll tell you. It's two. Here's another one. This is three. Cool. Let's look at another one. This one is four. Yes, four. Let's look at this one. This one is five. And the reason why Miss Thomas showed you all of these cool numbers, because we're going to learn how to count by using those number words. Like we're going to find out what did we see first in the book? What did we see second in the book? Um, what did we see third in the book? What did we see fourth in the book? And what did we see fifth? in the book you ready to take another picture walk okay so now we want to see what do we see first in the book you ready i'm ready so let's open it back up and see what we saw first in the book hmm i'm ready are you ready do you remember those we saw what first we saw circles first good job we saw, first, we saw circles. Yes? Yes. All right. So let's see what next, what we saw. So let's see what next is. Next means second. I was giving myself some thinking time. So let's see what we saw second in our book. You really remember his long, tall legs? Those are called rectangles. What are they called? Rectangles. So remember, we saw rectangles second. So here's my number for second. Yes, I saw rectangles second. Cool. So let's see what we saw third, okay? Third is like the uh, three number. You ready? I bet we saw some. I'm going to give you a hint. It's on the um, hat. Of the band players you see them they're green if you know the need another hint yes you got it we saw uh, uh, I'm sorry we saw squares sometimes Miss Thomas get a little boo -boo -boo, but it is okay we saw squares that was third here's the number four third we saw squares third you got it cool let's see what's next well, I'm finding the next shape. What do you think comes after third? So far, we had first, we've had second, and we had third. What do you think comes next? Hmm. This is my thinking face. Hmm. What comes third? I bet someone knows it. You do? Well, what is it? Is it fourth? Did you say fourth? You're right. Yes, it's fourth. Let's see what we saw fourth. I'll give you a hint. It's on the horses. It's on their backs. And then it's even down on the ground over here. Can you guess what it is? Did you guess triangles? 
Yes, I like your thinking. Yes, it is triangles. That's cool. I like that. So, so far, let's do a quick review. You told me that we saw circles first. Yes. We saw rectangles second. Yes. And we saw triangles third. Yes. Okay, cool. Or was it triangles fourth? Maybe it's fourth. Sometimes I forget, but guess what? It's okay. We're going to keep walking together. But this is how fourth looks. The number four is fourth. Are we ready? All right, let's keep going. Let's see what else we got. You ready? You remember these shapes here? You do? Great. Those are squares. Those are squares. Yes. So I can remember we saw squares fourth or we saw squares fifth, but it's okay. I'll still give you the number. So for fifth, we have the number five. We have fifth, the number five. You're doing real good. Okay. Let's see one more shape that you can remember. You ready? I bet you know. It's the bears. The bears are holding what? Rectangles. You got it. The bears are holding rectangles. You guys did a great job at remembering all the shapes you saw in this book. What you saw first, what you saw second, what you saw third, what you saw fifth. Let's look at it one more time. You ready? What did you see first? Okay, well, well, let's find it over here. Let's find what did you see first. I bet I know what it was. You ready? You got it. You saw the circles first. Good job. So let's see what we saw second. Hmm. Let's see. What did we see second? You ready? Triangles. You got it. Triangles. Good job. Let's see, what did we think we saw third? And we're just doing a review just to make sure you remember and remember the counting. What did we see third? Hmm, let's see. I hope it's over here. Hmm, okay, well, we'll just pick that one then. What is that one? A square? Yes, you got it. It's a square. I like that. A square. What do you think you saw fourth? Mm, let's see. Let's see if I'll shape over here. You ready? There's one. What's that? A rectangle. You got it. It can go sideways or it can go the tall way. Sideways or the long way or the tall way. That's fourth. And what else we have over here that's fifth? Let's see. Did we see it over here? No, I think we don't have it over there. But it's okay. We saw something fifth. We did. Okay. So we're going to put these things down here. We're going to put them back over here. So we already know if you go on a shape hunt around your house, you can find some cool things. But what if you don't have those things around your house? You know what else you can do? You can draw the shapes. You can have a big brother, a big sister, your mom, your dad, your grandma, even your grandpa can help you draw. And that's what I did. I drew some shapes. You want to know what I drew first? Here it comes. Yes, I drew my circle first. Let me see if I can find my number so I can help you. I drew the number, the circle first. I drew my circle first. Yeah, I got that. Okay, let's see what else that I drew. Just in case I don't have those things. Look what else I drew. And I colored it too. Can you guess what shape I drew? A square? I like your thinking. Yes, you drew a square. I drew a square. Let's see what's next. Remember that shape? It's a hexagon. Remember, it was the shape of my vase. A hexagon. Yeah. Let's see what else I drew. I drew a heart. Remember a heart? We didn't find it in the book, but I had it on my shirt. And there's my heart. It's pink. It's kind of light, but there it is. Okay, let's see what else I drew. I drew a oval. Yeah, I drew an oval. Yeah, remember the oval? It was shaped like 
a egg. Yep, shaped like an egg. You got it. Let's see what else I drew. Oh, wow. Look at him. You ready? A rhombus. Yeah, sometimes people call it a diamond, but in school, we call it a rhombus. Yeah, we call it a rhombus. Let's see what else I drew. I'm sorry. That was a rectangle. This was the rhombus. I told you, see, sometimes teachers, we don't, we mess up, but we keep going. And then I have a rectangle. Yes, a rectangle. And last one that I drew, you want to see it? A triangle. Yes, I drew a triangle. And you know what else I did? I made my favorite animal out of one of my shapes. Can you guess what my favorite animal is? It's sitting on my table and I even drew it out of the shapes. Can you guess what he is? He's on my table. You see him? Let's see if you can see him from my picture. Let's see. What is he? A giraffe. Gosh, you guys are so smart. And for you friends that like even writing, I drew a giraffe. He has a rectangle body. He has rectangle legs. He has a long rectangle neck. He has a rectangle head. And then for the eye, he has a circle for the eye. And you know what? For you friends that like to write, if you want to write, you can write some words about your giraffe. Mm -hmm. Whatever you want to do. That's if you want to do that. Okay? I have one more activity for you to do. For us to do. Like when we was writing today, we was writing and we was talking about first, second, and third. Well, I have some blocks and I want to show these blocks to you. Okay? So I'm going to ask you what block I'm going to hold up first. What color block? Can you tell me what color block that is? It's red. You're right. So that's going to be first. Okay, I'm going to hold up the next one. This one will be second. You guys, you guys are remembering. I like that. So it's going to be second. I'm going to put it right there. So my red is first. My yellow is second. Okay, what do you think is going to be third? What color is going to be third? Blue, yes, blue is third. What else you think I'm going to put on there? What's the next one? Remember, so we have first, second, third. You remember what comes after third? It's a green one. Fourth, you got it. Fourth comes after that. And we're going to do one more. So we got first, second, third, fourth one more what do you think comes after fifth did you guess fifth gosh i'm loving your thinking i'm loving it i'm loving it i'm loving it so there we go so guess what now we need to put some numbers to it are you ready i'm ready so now we're gonna write it now you get you ready because sometimes we can just say it but now let's write it so we can remember it so whatever we say we write it so we can keep it up there. That's what makes us smart. Are you ready? Let's do it. So our red was what? First. This is my number for first. And then I'm going to add my little, um, add my letters to it to make sure it's first. Okay. Now what was next was yellow. That's second. That's second. That's that number two. So red was first, yellow was second. Here's blue. What do you think is blue? Third, you got it. Yes, third, look at third. That's that number there. There's third. Awesome, we got third. So we have red is first, yellow is second, blue is third. What's that next color? You don't remember? It's okay, I'll tell you. It's green. Green's gonna come fourth. Good, green is fourth. Are we ready? 
So let's go back. So we have red is what? First, good. Yellow is second. I'm liking it. Blue is what? Third, gosh, you guys are doing good. Green is what? Fourth. And then we have an orange. Can you guess what orange is? Hmm. Someone said it. You got it. Fifth. Let's write out number five, four, fifth. You did it. And you did it with me. So let's go back over it because we almost time is up. We ready? So we have first, second, third, fourth, and fifth. Friends, that is almost all the time we have for each other. But I love the fact that you were really working with me. I could hear you out there. Wait, did one of you say, you see my favorite animal again? You do? I see him too. I'll put him back out. Because he, he wants to help us count. His name is Gerald the Giraffe. He likes to help us count. So you ready? He's going to help us count. Let's drill. Are you ready to help us count? He says, yeah. Okay, here we go. So red is what again? First, good. Yellow is, what'd you say? Oh, he said second. Did you say second? He said second too. Good. Blue is, what's the next color? Blue. And then it's what? Third. Yeah, it's third. Orange is what? Fourth? He said, yes. I got it. Green is fourth. That was orange. What's the next one? Orange is what? Fifth. Orange is fifth. And he really said, thank you for letting him come in and help with you. I think he's going to be in our lesson all the time because Gerald, he likes to learn. Do you like to learn? You do? Well, guess what? Let me tell you a secret. Me too. I like to learn too. So let's quickly do, go over our, our overview of all the things we talked about in our book. In our book, we did a great picture. Remember our book? Our book talked about what? Shapes. We talked about a circle, a square, a rectangle. We talked about all of those fun things in our book. I'm so glad you came with us. We talked about how to count things, right? What did we see first? What did we see second? What did we see third? What did we see fourth? We even did a shape hunt for the things that found in our house. The coolest one was a what? What's the coolest one we saw? I think this was the coolest one. An egg. We saw an egg in our house. And you know what else I didn't say? If you go in your pantry or help your mom help you, you can find a canned good. A canned good is shaped like a circle. Okay? Gosh, I had fun with you guys. I wish I could keep going on. But that's all the time I have for you today, friends. But guess what? I will see you again. I am so excited that you joined me. So I'll see you again next time. Okay, friends? Bye now.